I'm taking you to Dior to shop with me to see some of their new bags and the ready to wear pieces. I will share their price details as always. Don't forget to leave me a comment down below to let me know what do you think of these Dior pieces and what's on your Dior wish list. Without any further ado, let's get right into the video. I haven't been to Dior for a while and I saw there's some new bags in Dior and I hope to check out the Lady Dijoy bag in person today. I saw some Bokto Carol in different colors and the, the new Dior Vibe bag as well. At this moment, my favorite and the, the most classic Dior bag is still Lady Dior in my heart. How about you? Besides these small leather goods, there are also some Dior Bobby bag, Dior Carol bags in different colors as well. I got to check out the small Dior Carol bag in the calfskin and black color. It has the antique gold finish metal CD twist clasp. You just twist it and this is how you open it. The chain is also detachable. The Dior Carol is currently retail for $4,000. It's a bag that you can carry from day to night and it also has as the classic twist. What do you think of this Dior Carol bag? Remember I mentioned that I wanted to check out the Lady Dijoy bag in person? Apparently this bag has been popular and that they only have one Lady Dijoy bag in stock right now. Tada! Here you go! New in this season, the Lady Dijoy bag has the elegance and the beauty of Lady DL while still maintaining its own personality. It feels like a cropped version of Lady Dior to me. Besides the removable shoulder chain strap that you see here, it also has another adjustable and removable thicker shoulder strap for you to carry crossbody as well. This bag comes in different material like lambskin with bead embroidery or technical fabric material. This one is in the French calfskin here. The price of this bag varies based on different material. The calfskin one here is $4,900. The lambskin with bead embroidery is $8,400 and the technical fabric is $4,000. You can carry this bag in so many different ways. For example, with the thinner version removable shoulder chain or just hand carry the top handle. You can also wear it with the thicker and the longer shoulder strap for crossbody as well. To me, this bag is super similar to Lady Dior. This is a side-by-side -side comparison between the Lady Dijoy bag with the Lady Dior Ultra Matte in the medium size. The Lady Dior is not only longer but also thicker. Price-wise, the Ultra Matte Lady Dior in medium size is $6,000. One thing I want to point out is that the Lady Dijoy bag feels quite heavy for the bag of its size to me. So what do you think? Are you a team Lady Dior or Lady D Joy? Leave me a comment down below to let me know. Going through their stairs, besides the bags, I also get to check out their shoes and ready-to-wear pieces on the second floor. I tried on some ready-to-wear pieces. Besides the price of their ready-to-wear pieces, I will also show you how the bags look together with their ready-to-wear. The first one I tried on is their D-Day Windbreaker in the gold tone technical jacquard material with the zip closure and a hoodie in the back. It's an oversized sportswear style. I really love the casual vibe of this windbreaker. The pocket is always a plus to me. It's just so Dior. The details and the fabric of the windbreaker looks amazing in person. It's also really lightweight and I'm wearing a size extra small here. The casual vibe plus the luxurious material details make it perfect for San Francisco. What do you think? Also, do you like it with the Dior Carol bag? 
This wing breaker is currently retail for $5,100. You probably can tell that this gold tone fabric is my favorite from Dior after I checked out all their ready to wear pieces. This hooded dress is in the same fabric and style as the wing breaker. The sportswear inspiration is further enhanced by the elastic waistband with a drawstring cord and a Christian Dior signature band on the side. And I can totally wear the ring breaker over this dress for a matchy matchy look as well, right? I really love the fabric and the, the details here. I paired this dress with the Lady D Joy bag. What do you think? This dress is also available in other prints. This one I'm trying on here is in the size 36 and this dress is currently retail for $4,300. Personally, between the wing breaker and the dress, the wing breaker might be a more practical option for me for the SF weather. How about you? Which one do you like better? Leave me a comment down below to let me know. Besides the sportswear style looks, I also got to check out some pieces that I have been dreamed about for a very long time. Like this 30 mountain bar jacket here. It's in the white single breasted wool and the silk material. It may look a regular blazer to you, but this bar jacket is actually an emblematic style from Dior's new look collection, which was first created in 1947. This blazer features the notched lapel and the well pockets that delicately highlight the waist. The waist area is actually super flattering. It's single breasted and it has three buttons in the front, 77% of wool and 23% of silk the material. It elevates your look instantly and it gives you this elegant and refined look. And I'm wearing a size 34 here, which is my normal size. If you like the slim fit, definitely take your normal true size. If you want to move more freely, consider one size up. I have to admit that I'm obsessed with this elegant blazer and it's just so flattering. This blazer is currently retail for $4,700. What do you think of this one? Leave me a comment down below to let me know. To look more Dior, I tried to pair with the blazer with their signature skirt. Voila! This is Dior's mid-length pleated skirt. This tulle skirt is a bit transparent and highlights the waist with a wide flat belt. It has a side zip closure. It goes so well with the bar jacket. If you want to go for an iconic Dior silhouette look, they are the perfect match. These days, I'm usually opt for jeans or pants for my busy work and mommy duties, but I have to admit that I'm so smitten and this is my favorite of everything that I have seen today. This look just reminded me how romantic and how pretty an outfit can make me feel. I paired this look with the Lady D Joy bag and that they look really good together, right? The skirt I'm trying on here is in the size 36 and I feel size 34 will fit me better. The pleated skirt is currently retail for $4,500. Which one is your favorite among everything from Dior today and what's on your Dior wish list? Leave me a comment down below to let me know and I'll see you soon. Bye bye!